If the hair gets dry, this is the first stage that you know your hair is in trouble. Depending on the length of the hair that you see broken off, you'll know if the hair has broken off on the ends or is it at the root level. Some of us will lose hair at the root level. And what we look for at that time? A bulb at the end. That little white bulb that you see at the end of the hair, like an exclamation point, it tells a lot. It has your DNA there as well. We don't need blood to know if you're on narcotics. We just need a strand of hair. And everything that you put inside your body will be registered on that strand of hair. Um, hair products that we use will sometimes change color when they come in touch with some types of medication. So medication, past or present, must be shared with your hairdresser. You must share that kind of information because it could mean postponing when you're going to do a particular service. Let's say you want to relax the hair and you're on certain types of medication. It might be advisable to finish the medication first and then we relax your hair. Stay away from the shampoos that dry a lot. Right? As soon as your scalp is too dry, it will start itching. It will give you little, little signs. So it's important that if you tangle easily, if you are prone to tangles, hydrating the hair with a hydrating shampoo would be a better choice than to use, say, a sulfate shampoo. It's also very conditioning. So a shampoo that has conditioners built into it will be able to comb through. We're beautiful like diamonds in the sky. Shine bright like a